I'm attorney Martin Nicholson from the law office of Martin Nicholson. I'm here with my legal assistant, Bran. Hello. And she's going to ask me a frequently asked question. How can I request contact with the alleged victim if, when there is a no contact order in place? So if there is a no contact order in place, you don't want to contact the alleged victim. If there is a protective order in place, you don't want to contact the alleged victim or the person that is protected. Otherwise, you can get a new case and you don't want that. The best way to go about it is hiring an attorney and that attorney can contact the alleged victim in the case. The attorney can contact if they have an attorney or if it's a prosecutor that's helping them can contact the prosecutor and say that my client, you know, wants the clothes out of the house. If it's a situation like that, or say that it's my understanding, the alleged victim wants the no contact order removed and then we can file for it to get reviewed to see if the alleged victim or the complaining witness shows up to court to ask for it to be removed. But you do not want to contact them without the assistance of an attorney.